when Diva told me that she taught her little boy how to say that and we thought we'd copy it because it's really funny. Gracie, say, all right, girls. All right, girls. <laughs> yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right, see you in a bit, honey. I love you. Should we go? Yeah. Let's go. I think most people hate Monday mornings. I really love Monday mornings because it's the one morning of the week where I have silence when I get ready and I get to get ready by myself and I have a house to myself and it's just really, really nice. Don't get me wrong, you know I love the boys. You know I miss Grayson so, so much when he's at nursery. I always love to go and get him and have him back. But this one morning a week where I get to just get ready by myself in the silence is just so nice. <laughs> We're here. We're going to say goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye. So see you later, everyone. So see you later, everyone. Bye bye. Okay, that will do. I'm just about to take some of the makeup bags over to the post office. Thank God, now we can actually walk through our hallway and now I'm going to go home and wrap the next 30. <laughs> setting up for a blog post and we're setting up to film doing my makeup. Which is lucky that Grayson's not here because all of this would be on the floor in various different places by now, wouldn't it? It would be, yeah, and the whole house would be on fire. <laughs> I want a hippopotamus for Christmas only a hippopotamus will do. Not a stupid doll. No Two flat laid down. This is the um, like main bit of the gift guide now. So I've put everything together and it looks like this. I'm pretty pleased with it. Santa Claus will mind you. He will not have to use our dirty chimney flu. Just bring him through the front door, that's the easy thing to do. Bit of good news on the want feed front. There has been now just shy of half a million products manually uploaded by users. That's people finding stuff that they want and putting it on want feed. Just under half a million. That's crazy to think that people have uploaded half a million products to want feed. Like, it's just astonishing. I don't think I've ever said that word, astonishing. I'm gonna say that more often. I'm annoying myself. See you tomorrow, guys. Bye. Night. Night. <laughs> Say goodnight, everyone. <laughs> Say goodnight. Say night, night. Santa baby, just slip a sable under the tree. We are off to go and get our Christmas tree this morning. It's the 1st of December, I feel like it's acceptable. Every year I basically have to force Steph to get a real tree because he's like, where are we going to put it? We've got no room. And then whenever we get it, you're always really happy that we've got a real one, aren't you? I always think we should decorate the house plants because we've got like so many house plants, we just throw some lights on the house plants. some saggy old house, house plants. I love Christmas now, but I do find it hard at the same time because everyone's always like, oh, are you going to go and see your family? And I'm like, no, they, they've passed away, yeah. so um, I'm just staying here. <laughs> but now I have a family, so it's yeah, good. <laughs> it's good again this year. <laughs> yeah. I've had some really grim Christmases in my past. Yeah, me too. <laughs> well, let's pick this up and get a nice Christmas tree. <laughs> yeah, let's um, let's save this Vlogmas day too. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Santa baby, a 54 convertible to light. Home base really brings out my inner dad. I'll wait up for you, dear. 
Santa baby, so hurry down the chimney tonight. Think of all the fun. This is one of my favourite bits of the year, strangely, where we drive home with this big tree sticking in between us. It reminds me of being a kid. Um, we're gonna go home and I'm gonna soak this in a bucket overnight because that's what my mum always did and apparently it keeps the needles in for longer and they don't fall off. So we're gonna do that and decorate it tomorrow, I think. Is that your Christmas tree? Yeah. And really, it's not a lie. Cause I've been an angel all year Santa baby, don't forget And hurry tonight What? What are you eating? I was eating a... Grow a cracker How do you eat so loudly? You literally hit me on the other side of the room eating that bloody cracker I managed to get some blogging done While Gracie was down for his nap I finished my Christmas gift guide And that is up on my blog now I'm going to link to that in case any of you want to go and read it or if you need a hand with Christmas present ideas or if you're struggling to think of anything that you might like for Christmas say all right girls no <laughs> makes him really angry now when I ask him to do it all right girls no a is for apple, apple. b is for ball b apple. c is for car Yeah. <laughs> Can you make the horsey sound? Can I come on the horse? No! Okay, I'll get off. <laughs> Grayson's going through this stage where he's really like all about mummy. Everything's mummy. Mummy, mummy, mummy. Oh, God. All day. Every day. Hold on. Hold on tight. <laughs> Hold on. Ah, oh, careful! <laughs> Gracie, see you tomorrow. Mwah. Oh, that was a nice kiss. It wasn't a headbutt this Mwah. time. Mwah. 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 Okay, that's one. Mwah. Oh, thanks, Grace. I love you. See you tomorrow, Gracie. Mwah. Okay. Mwah. <laughs> Night, girls. Say, Night, girls. Alright, girls. Mwah. Mwah. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, but maybe that's enough now. See you later, Gracie. Ready for bed? Should we go downstairs? Night, Gracie. See you tomorrow. Mwah. I love you. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire Black frost nipping at your nose Yuletide carols being sung by your quiet folks Dressed up like Eskimos Everybody knows Good morning! Gracie and I are heading to a little soft play centre today with his little mates. We're running really, really late. I hate being late so much. The season bright. Do you want a baby Chino? Yeah. Say baby Chino. Baby Baby Chino. Yeah. find it hard to sleep tonight. Project. Where Grayson out is done. I'm gonna head home now. I've got a blog post to finish and tons of makeup bags to wrap. He's loaded lots of toys and goodies on his sleigh. And every mother's child. Hey! Grayson is going to sleep now. I'm vlogging. Oh, sorry. Seth's just going, what's that? Yeah, Grayson's gone down for his nap, so I'm gonna do a bit for my blog. 
and chill. Oh. I've been trying to finish this blog post now for about three days. Okay. Vlogging again, oh. Steph. Every time I say something on camera, Steph's like, what? Got the headphones on, so I don't know. Uh, um, yeah, I've been trying to finish this blog post for like three days now. And Grayson just doesn't want to let me do it. I just don't know how people who have children blog because it's impossible. Sometimes it makes me really frustrated because that's part of my previous life that I don't want to give up. But it's like more and more likely that I have to give it up because I have a screaming child who just needs constant attention. <sighs> I think I'm gonna have a mummy meltdown. Here he is. Made it to the sofa, didn't ya? You're gonna be a good boy. You're gonna be a good boy, Gracie. He's going, yeah. You're gonna be a good boy? Do you want some chocolate? I am off to the shops to get Hannah some Prosecco. I think she feels under quite a lot of pressure. So we're gonna try and take the edge off today with some, some medicine in the form of Prosecco. Say, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Delirious child that has a nap. <laughs> All right, girls. Give me a kiss. <laughs> You're right. Yeah. Still not asleep. You're still not asleep? Oh my god, he's such a little terrorist. You want a glass? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, coming up. Thank you. Santa baby, a 54 convertible to light. I'm having a mental breakdown. You're <laughs> ruining my mental breakdown. <laughs> <laughs> is that how people have mental breakdowns? Yeah. This is this is the start. I'm shaving my head in a minute. <laughs> Grayson, look what you've done to your mum. <laughs> Think of all the fun I missed. Think of all the fuss that I We're about to decorate the Christmas tree. This is our little stand. I think we're gonna put it there. We don't really have room for a Christmas tree, but I forced Steph to buy a Christmas tree anyway. Look, that looks a bit like a Christmas tree. We could have put lights and tinsel on that. It would have looked lovely. I don't know why you made me get a tree. You love Christmas trees. I do. They do smell nice and look nice, but we could have saved a lot of time and hassle if we used them. Santa baby, so hurry down the chimney tonight. <laughs> <laughs> There's one more thing I really do need. The D. One, two, three. Cheers! Cheers! Cheers. Then, let's go. Life is all peaks and troughs, there's always ups and downs and at the moment Hannah is feeling a little bit of a down. She goes through this thing about once every few months where she feels really withdrawn, really insular. It's not exactly easy to vlog when you feel that way because it's the last thing that you want to do. So I may have to take the reins on it a little bit. I'm sorry for those of you who find me insufferable but um, I'm just, I've just got to do it until she kind of feels good again. So she'll be back, she's just... Um, just, this happens every now and again. Yeah. Right, Mister, go to sleep. Yeah. I need to edit the video. Mummy's gone out. <laughs> oh God! Oh, thank God for that. I'm a little bit. Hi right now. <laughs> I just went to the dentist 
and had a lot of anaesthetic. I don't think I've ever enjoyed the dentist as much as I enjoyed the dentist today. And I was actually looking forward to someone drilling into my mouth just so I could just sit there and do nothing, which sounds really strange. But apparently lots of mums like the dentist. Before we begin, I would like to address some Philistines out there who do not appreciate or understand latte art. So I want to talk to you guys for a second and tell you what latte art isn't. And latte art isn't a nice bit of foam arranged in a cup in a particular way to look aesthetically pleasing. That is kind of what it is, but it's it goes beyond that. It goes way beyond that. The clues in the name art. Art is an expression. Art is a statement. So why do I want to perfect latte art so badly and why am I wasting your time and my time taking you on this rocky old journey of mine to do it? It's because it leads somewhere. It leads to a better man and I'm determined to be him and this road has been treacherous and it's been rocky and there's times I've, I've floundered and I've wanted to stop and get off and be like, I can't do this anymore. But you know what? That's all part of the journey. And a lot of you might think I'm talking hot air right now. I'm talking crap. And I've got something to say to you. I'm not. I will conquer this. And when I do, you'll be there with me, guys. Right there with me. Let's go. Come on. Some of you might call this beautiful latte art. I call it one step closer to being a better man. Cheers. Look, over here, come here. <laughs> That's, so That's so cute. Every so often I find vlogging a little bit more difficult than it probably is. I'm pretty sure you can all guess that, that every so often it is that time of the month. It just all kind of overwhelms me a little bit and gets on top of me and so I feel like I just need to run away from it for a couple of hours. So that's what I did today. I'm sure you can probably tell because with vlogmas there is no hiding. <laughs> Hello. I have invited a couple of, yeah, Zach's here. I've invited a couple of my friends over tonight, Zach and Jack, just to chill out for a bit. Freedom! Freedom! Look, there he is. Do you recognize him? <laughs> There's a smile. How have you been, man? Are you good? Excellent, how are you? Yeah, good. Nice to see you. Yeah, good to see you too. Yeah. All right, wine, let's crack this open, mate. I need this so badly right now. More than you can ever realize. Yes, and you broke the five pound barrier. Thanks, mate. Yeah, exactly. Did you? Yeah, Bloody hell. Tony's home and Jack's Say good night to everyone. Good night. Jack, say good night to everyone. Good night. Say good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Creepy old bastard. <laughs> um, good night, everyone. See you tomorrow. Bye. Fade to back. Fade to back. Fade to back. You will forgive me. 
We're gonna have a Mitchellac family outing this morning because we haven't really been out together this week, have we? Because Steph's been editing a lot, obviously for Vlogmas. I've been having a bit of a PMT meltdown crisis all week. Cut. And um, right. Grayson's Cut. been really difficult, so we're gonna go to our favorite place, Wisely Garden. Right, should we go, Grace? <laughs> white car. Oh yeah, white car, well done. We've already had an argument because we're both tired and hungry, but we've rectified the hunger. Grayson has fallen asleep and it's only like 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm so happy to go to Wisely Garden. And it is beautiful today. I've got a little grumpy baby today. Yeah, he doesn't even want to walk. This is one of our favourite places to come in the whole of England, I think, isn't it? I love it. It makes me feel so calm. Whenever you're stressed about anything, you come here and you feel like you can just breathe. Yeah. I love it. It's my happy place. <laughs> when I die, this is when I, where I want to end up. Should I bury you here? Yeah. Please. I think that'll cost a lot of money then. <laughs> just secretly sprinkle me round here. Okay, I'll secretly <laughs> sprinkle you round here. Yeah, I asked them when I came here, I was like, uh, when am I allowed to fly my drone in here? And they were like, no. Can you listen to how like, peaceful that is? Just yeah, birds it's amazing, in the river.
take 170. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like we our to... vlog this week has gone through so many peaks and troughs yeah. because we obviously weren't in our comfort zone this week and we had to kind of readjust to get used to daily vlogging. It seems like by the end of it that we've both really enjoyed it. Did you like it? I did, which really shocked me. I didn't at the beginning of the week. I was like, why are we doing this? This is horrible. There's so much more pressure on it all. And yeah. I felt a bit suffocated by it. But by the end of the week, and after everyone's support, like our friends' support and our viewers' support, like it's just been totally worth it. And it's just been really enjoyable. Do you know, I've liked how much it's exposed us. I've yeah. liked how much exposed it has. Like it literally, like you, you cannot hide on a daily vlog. Like, no, you can't you are, hide from vlogmas. You are totally exposed because yeah. you're doing it every day. And like some days you wake up and you're like, I'm a dick today. Like you know, you wake up sometimes and you're like, you're you're just like in a shit mood and you just feel like I, I hate everything. Yeah, <laughs> that's why I run away to Top Shop. Whenever yeah. I run away to Top Shop, you know I'm having a mental Hannah crisis. Basically, Hannah's therapy is like buying pants from Topshop. That's what she's got like drawers, like stuff full of pants that she's never worn because the only way she gets over like emotional breakdowns is to go and buy pants. She's like, I'm off to go pants shopping. I'm like, we've just got too much to pants. The, I'm just going to the like Topshop pants section and I just get really angry. Yeah, I'm surprised you're in Oxford Street's Topshop pants section. Like, that's like not exactly the most tranquil of surroundings to I don't be know in. why I go there. It's been quite an emotional journey and for I'm, us. I'm really glad that you guys can see our reasoning behind all this. I'm really glad that you guys can see why we're doing this. Yeah. I'm really glad that you guys know that we're doing this. Fundamentally, the main reasons for Grayson. And I'm really glad that it shows you that. And I like the fact it's exposed us more. And I like the fact it's pushed us creatively more. I have two blog posts this week and one is a Christmas gift guide which I'm very proud of and I really enjoyed photographing and like creating. I just found it really fun. I love the flat lay. I'm a little bit of a flat lay addict. Mm. I think I need to go to like flat lay rehab. <laughs> Every day I'm like, oh, I could do a flat lay. And then I'm like, no, I just did one. They're gonna get really boring. But yeah, one is a Christmas gift guide and one is a beauty post. And I will link them both below in case you're interested and you want to go and read after this. Bye, see you later. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up. <laughs> Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Stop it now. Go to bed. Oh, we have a crunchy. I see the crunchy. Wave and say goodbye. Yes, yeah, the other crunchy. I'll see you here right now. Do I look like crunchy or crushed? You look like you've had both. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh, I'm doing it really well. Look. Oh. I'm actually doing it. Look, we've got a crunchy to eat right now. I'm so good at being on Chilla Crushed. <laughs>